Hello everyone, I'm Aaron, a birding naturalist. Welcome back to my channel. Have you ever seen these big trees, sort of reddish bark that peels in these thin layers? Let's talk about them. So this is a Pacific Madrone tree. It's an evergreen and it's a beautiful native tree to much of Western North America, stretching from, especially the coastal areas, British Columbia, down to about Santa Barbara County. You can identify one of these things because of its sort of orange reddish bark that peels in these thin layers and the leaves that are this broad oval shape and you can see a kind of waxy in, in cover and in texture. Uh, very pretty tree, like I said, an evergreen, so the leaves stay all year long. In spring, it'll have these really pretty sort of bell-shaped pink flowers, which then transform into berries in autumn and into winter. And that's actually something I'm going to talk about later. Madrones are drought tolerant. And they're often found alongside Douglas firs. So you get these Douglas fir madrone forests a lot. They love to live in sort of dry, rocky soils, and they're really well adapted to fire. They will re-sprout. If a big fire comes over and burns off an entire tree, the trunks will re-sprout. If a fire comes through and burns off partial parts of a tree, they will re-sprout from their sort of injured limbs. And these trees produce a lot of seeds and the seeds re-sprout really well after a fire. Those berries that persist through autumn and into winter are a really important food source. In wintertime, oftentimes there's not lots of other food sources available. And so where there is something with berries, lots of calories, some sugars, that kind of thing, it becomes really, really important. And so there are a lot of birds and mammals that eat a lot of madrone berries. Also, madrones form a very important nesting habitat for a lot of birds. A lot of birds have been shown to actually prefer madrones to many other species of trees. And part of this is because of the thick foliage, lots of cover, but also part of it is actually kind of because of this thin bark. It means that madrones are kind of susceptible to some pathogens, some diseases, which cause sometimes some of their limbs to rot and to form cavities in their trunks. And cavities are often a very rare, hard to find resource. So cavity nesting birds are always very much on the lookout for a cavity in a tree. And since madrones have lots of cavities, that makes them very important to a lot of these cavity nesting birds. Unfortunately, madrones are kind of facing some, some threats. There's some conservation issues. Their populations are declining for a few different reasons. One is, has to do with that fire. These are actually a great fire adapted species. And so when fire is excluded from a landscape, that actually makes it harder for them to reproduce and sustain their populations. So with better fire management, it would be hoped that madrones would come back strong. But until a lot of really aggressive, really good fire management is placed in the landscape, it's kind of rough for this species. Another issue is development. Madrones love to live in beautiful coastal mountain kind of habitats. And we humans, we really like to live there too. And so a lot of development has really impacted a lot of madrones. And finally, invasive species are a problem. There are several different invasive species that tend to outcompete and push out madrones. One of them is Scotch broom, which I actually did a video about, and I'll link in the description. Um, and so, yeah, the, the Scotch broom and a couple of other invasives make it really hard for the seedlings, especially, of a madrone to get started. And so they kind of outcompete them from an area. So, Pacific madrones. 
drought tolerant, fire adapted, very important food and nesting resource for a lot of different species, a wonderful California native, just a great tree to get to spend some time with. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for the view. Until next time, enjoy the natural world. <laughs>